Good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and this is Lumber Tycoon 2. And tonight we are joined with Blobby. Hello, Blobby. Hello. So, are you ready to help me? Gonna build up my house? Yes. Woo! <laughs> so, we've already ensured that we are whitelisted with each other. Uh, we have a wonderful elm tree. Already started cutting and pulling some of the wood inside. Uh, all this is gonna get stacked up Ooh, and stacked up right over here as we build the blueprints that we need. Um, my plan for tonight was to finish out the top of the roof and then start in on floor two. So I got a little bit of cleanup that I need to do up there. But yeah, I think that's that's pretty much the plan. And basically just sitting here talking with you guys because that seems to be the more awesome videos is when we don't really like have a plan. We're going to be building the house, but it's more or less just talking, and I like that. And by the way, this is Meryl. Hello, Meryl. Saw us uh, yesterday helping him with his door. He's like so thankful for it. By the way, how many trailer loads? Uh, just one, please. How many truck loads of lumber do you need? Says Meryl. So, uh, do, 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 do. I was thinking of something. What was I thinking of? I was going through my comments and realizing that there's still a lot of mean comments out there in the world. And that I'm not the only one that gets them. So, I wanted to talk to you guys kind of about bullying. Because I can remember back to the first time I got bullied. Well... Well, at least the first time I can remember. And it was back whenever I was really young. I was back in an old neighborhood that I used to live in. And I was about four, maybe five years old. Like, I don't think I'd even started kindergarten. But I do remember when I had gotten bullied. Um, there was a girl down the street. And she was roller skating one day. And I remember I wanted to go roller skating too. And this was this was before the time of like um, boyfriend, girlfriend ideas and stuff like that. I just, I really liked her and I liked hanging out with her. So I went and got my skates that my mom had got me. And I remember that they were kind of this maroonish brown color and they had a little jelly bean guy or a little jelly bean character on them. And my mom helped me put them on. She knew I was wanting to go outside and go skating. Because I had seen her down a few streets in like a driveway, just skating around. So <clears throat> I got my skates on and I didn't know how to skate back then. This was, uh, if you've ever seen my Draw My Life series, um, I was really good at skating. But um, this was on like roads and streets and it wasn't in a skate park or anything like that so anyhow I remember going down there and some of the other neighborhood kids had seen me going down there as well and they had met up with her and they started making fun of my roller skates and saying that they were a girl's color and then they started in on asking if uh, this girl was my girlfriend and making fun saying that I really liked her and everything else and I remember them circling around me and pushing me and making me fall down and eventually making me cry and go home but I wasn't mean to them in fact these were the same kids that were in the neighborhood that I I play with like all the time as they grew up, I grew up as well, and we were all still friends, but that was the first instance of where I had been bullied by friends, and it still sticks in my mind today. So I wanted to let you guys know that everyone gets bullied. It's not something uncommon. What we can control is how we deal with it. And one way is to absolutely just talk about it. Let somebody know. 
because you're not alone. Sorry, that got that got really deep really quick. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Blobby, do you remember any time that you were? Oh, actually, do you remember the first time that you were bullied and how you handled it? I was bullied quite a lot, and I just completely ignored it. I don't really care at all what people think about me. But like any one instance that sticks out in your mind that you handled in a correct way. <laughs> po positive message, please. Positive, positive message. No, no revenge uh, stories. <laughs> well, this one time, like I like took a person's house and like walked into another street. No, I'm kidding. No, I don't think I can't think of any. <laughs> But the idea that somebody doesn't get bullied, everybody deals with it at one point or another, and it's a thing of human nature. It happens. It doesn't mean you have to put up with it, and it doesn't have to be an everyday thing. If you are getting bullied, tell somebody. Don't, don't push it down. Don't suppress it. Don't bottle it up. Because that's that's worse than the bullying actually happening. Um, and, and did I miss a whole bunch there? Those two small pieces of wood won't get sawmilled. They just like stay how they are. Or are they too small? They might be too small. I've never had an experience of anything being too small in this game, hmm. like in a piece of wood. Well, we'll let that come out. Right. Can we take this one and put it back through the opposite direction? Let's see. We, we probably shouldn't have filled up that top lip reverse. <laughs> there it goes. Here, you hold that one in place. I'll throw this one right there. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, try grabbing a bigger piece. Okay. Here. Uh, try grabbing a piece right there. I can, I can do this. We'll just move that out of the way. There we go. There we are. See, simple solutions. Um, good. Oh, dude. Um, we got a piece of wood stuck inside of it. <laughs> um. See, and this is oh. how you do angles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, show them these little glitch pumpkin things. Oh. They look amazing. Yes, uh, the disco balls. As we came in, we saw that the. Uh, <laughs> But is it? It's not the texturing. It's the uh, the mesh is messed up on the pumpkins. So there's actually a flat edge to the pumpkin. So this is this is the shape that the game sees. This is uh, very interesting, by the way. <laughs> and then the coal as well. Does the coal have a? Uh, it's a perfect circle. Looks more like a rock snowball than a piece of cool wool. <laughs> She's if only did that with the gifts too, that would have been awesome. Uh, actually, let's go look at an eyeball. Do you think it actually happened to one of the eyeballs? I, I don't know. That's what we're going to go find out. Um, let's see. Out of all the times that stuff is on my base, the one time that I'm looking for an actual eyeball, it's like, oh, it's not there. Hold on. It's only can check my base. Oh, here I we like, go. Oh. Oh yeah. Uh, the eyeballs are messed up too. I like eyeballs without pupils. Uh, I was more interested in the uh, the shape because it's got that one flat edge. I don't understand why these ones have a flat edge. I think it's I literally think just, just a. The it's literally shape. just a. This one's just a sphere with a decal on it, isn't it? Mm-hmm. I think yeah, all so of them are. Well, technically, the pumpkins are spheres too. Pumpkin, but the, the yeah, mesh. but the pumpkins are mesh. The pumpkins have meshes and stuff, which is why they have well, cut out parts. Oh, I, th <laughs> I thought I thought a wobble head was all messed up. I'm like, look, the texture <laughs> of this one's a square. <laughs> hey, look at look at this head. It's a square. Actually, I'm pretty sure there is a square head in this game, but I mean not this game, but Roblox. Yeah. 
Hey, you have to do the glitch heads. Mm-hmm. Uh, one of these was given to me by one of the creeper companies. And then uh, I think the other one was... Oh, gosh. It was only like four or five weeks ago. Well, it, it was probably longer because time's, time tends to fly by whenever you're a YouTuber. <laughs> Oh, it's so weird. See my little glitch tad from over there. All right, I'm gonna get back to work. <laughs> I was about to say, I'm like, wait, we still have an episode to do. We're so excitable about the uh, the heads and the the glitches and cool stuff. Uh, should we get this piece of wood out of this block? <laughs> <laughs> nah, it gives it characteristic. It's cool. It'll, uh, it should work itself out once we start moving things around. Oh, I can move it. Look. You can move it left and right. Interesting. This is a very interesting server. <laughs> it's, it's right here. There you go. Code, the this, train is half full. Does he mean car? I think he's got a car with some trailers attached to it train loads. That's awesome. Yeah. I'll start moving these up and finishing out the second floor. And then... I oh, should also no. build the wood. Can you build the stuff? Oh gosh. Oh gosh. There it goes. We're gonna have second floor done in no time. Like I said, for the first floor, I just kind of want it to be uh, a museum slash items area. I'll have to figure out like a carpet or something for the floor. That'll be cool. <laughs> Crazy Party Creep's like, oh my gosh, Blobby! Hello, Crazy Party Creep. There we go. Let's move this right. Here. Oh gosh. Hi, Code. Hello. Crazy party creep. He looked different the other day. He had a, a different outfit on. The lag in this thing is real. Aw, he says you're the best. Thank you. Smile of face. Hmm. Are they actually too small? I've never had that happen. No, I think it really is glitch that's going on. Like, the lag in the server is amazingly real today. Yeah, but it's also a very interesting server. What is your favorite band? Um, <clears throat> favorite band. Favorite band. Hmm. Daft Punk? I mean, if I have to choose off the top of my head, I'll, I'll go with Daft Punk, but I love all kinds of music. I like, um, I like classical. I like techno. I like some country. Not all country. I can't. I can't do like the the really really sad songs and the older versions of them. That's. Ugh. I can listen to it if I got that's somebody a good that's. Amount of country. Yeah. If if somebody's um, into country, I'll listen to it with them. But for the most part, I like uh, '80s '90s rock, alternative garage bands I mean some of the bands that I listened to growing up were like <clears throat> oh gosh I don't know if I can even mention it um, Nine Inch Snails, Tool Metallica, No Doubt yes I said No Doubt and their Skull Band it was before Gwen Stefani um, split off and did her own thing But yeah. 21 Pilots. 21 Pilots is a good band. 
they talk about uh, mental health issues on there. Well, I'm not sure that they talk about mental health issues, but uh, it's definitely incorporated into their... <laughs> Are you punching me with a... Hey, 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 hey. We use our words, Blobby. We use our words. <laughs> okay, <minutes>. what? <laughs> Um, I just did magic and made these wood disappear. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, you did. That's great. It was awesome. You're gonna laugh when you see the video. Did you, like, grab the piece of wood from out of my hands? <laughs> I grabbed it out of your hands and threw it into a blueprint real quick. <laughs> How did you do that? I didn't even know you could. If, I, uh, if I'm holding a piece and you're whitelisted, like this piece right here. Oh, wait. Where'd you go? Oh, he ran. You can grab it and take off with it, as long as I don't move. I, start I didn't even know that. I was looking down at my phone while I was moving my mouse, and then all of a sudden I just look back and I see the wood <laughs> just gone. That's awesome. Um, let's see, we'll, we'll use the yellow later on. Crazy, why did you do that? I like I boneless bones. I feel like we've been recording for quite a long time. It, it feels like a long time, doesn't it? Would you believe it's only been 16 minutes? It's about Seriously? half an episode. Wow. Well, I mean, if you did the four episodes a day, we'd be giving them overtime. Oh, gosh. Hmm. Well, even... Then again, a lot of the time when you record with me, it's overtime. <laughs> even just a... Uh... Oh, gosh, what happened there? Um... Andreas FL. There is a piece over here. Oh, oh, that was something else I wanted to do. I actually wanted to read off some of those mean comments. Not some of the, like, super mean ones, but like... I was about to say. There is a, there's one person that said, is this dude dyslexic? And I think they were referring to me, like, messing up my words and getting certain things backwards. And to answer your question, no, I am not dyslexic. Uh, I am ADHD, which causes my brain to function faster than sometimes I can get my words out, faster than I can read or write. Um, it's just a matter of not being able to express myself sometimes, which comes off as dyslexia sometimes. So, you should never be embarrassed about not being able to read properly, or read like everyone else. And if people make fun of you for it, that's wrong. <laughs> I feel like the entire episode's turning into a... <laughs> like a... Psychology... Thing. That's not what this yeah, is. I'm pretty sure it is at this point. <laughs> it's a talk show. It's Code Primate's uh, talk show. There we go. Welcome to Special Code Special guest, incredibly quiet blobby. <laughs> you, you've gotten better. I mean, you used to be a lot more quieter than this. I remember when <laughs> you didn't even have a microphone. It was just chat all the time. And then I dig in the microphone and then I was too nervous to even use it. <laughs> Do you remember the first episode where you used a microphone? It was this year. Ah, uh, yes, I do. So, that was your most nervous one ever, wasn't it? Yeah, more or less. <laughs> You've come a far, far away since then, just saying. We got pieces not going through here. Clear the way. Crazy party creep, what are you doing, dude? Oh, he's got like three train loads. <laughs> this serve is like the laggy serve I've ever been in. Crazy party creep, stop, dude. Stop, 
I wanted to keep that there so we could uh, have the lights on it. You cannot escape me. <laughs> I wasn't going anywhere. Does, do they need us to move the logs out of the way? Hi. Yeah. All, all the logs. Zoop. There we go. Mm. What in the world did I just do? <laughs> there you go. There you go. All I flung clear. a log into the air, jumped on it, grabbed it, and then jumped off of it. <laughs> nice. Thanks, Lonnie Pony. Is it Lonnie Pony? Lynn Pony. It's Lynn Pony. Or is it Lynn Pony? Ah, <gasps> to Pony! <laughs> that was a horrible neigh. I should, I should not neigh like that. <clears throat> I think we have more than enough wood. <laughs> These are the pieces that did not go through. Oh my gosh, the, the lag. The lag. Code screen. Uh, we will take a big screen shot at the end. Okay. By the way, did you see what I did with this chair over here? Uh, it's on the wall. That's about all I know. It's a way to get up. Chair ladder. Interesting. <laughs> I wonder if you jump, sit in a chair, and then jump up, would it put you in a chair above it? Uh, yeah. That was the idea behind the... I need to make an elevator out of chairs. Yeah, that was the idea behind the, the chair elevator, remember? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> and then there's the opposite effect, which is the chair down here, which... Oh, the, up, the upside down chair. <laughs> Uh oh, look out, Lynn. Is somebody glitching out a car again? Dude, what is crazy doing? Wait, how did they claim this wood? Which one? Did you whitelist them? There's like a big block of wood that we mined, that we chopped earlier. Um, if we didn't chop it in a certain amount of time, the ownership just goes away. So. Yeah, I thought it was like 20 minutes before it went away, though. Mm, no, it's it's really not that long. And I think it might be reset by server, so the timer could be at like 15 minutes or 12 minutes. Like, we don't know where it starts or ends at. I wish there was like an actual item that just looked like this, because they look amazing. Oh, oh the... Uh... Yeah, I just realized... Good, I realized something. What? The purple and black um, square, the purple and black circles on this thing are the exact same thing on the end times axe. Wait, what? If you pull out an end times axe, they're like the exact oh. same thing. What? The end times texture is? The glitched out pumpkin texture. The, the, what do they call it? The dark pumpkin. That is a great find. That is awesome. Yeah, I found something. Whoa. Blobby just discovered something. This is amazing. <laughs> They're like, what? What? What is it? What? Come. Take a look. The dark pumpkin, pumpkin, look at the texture. See the pattern? Look at the end times X. <coughs> See the pattern? Dun dun dun. Same, same. 
the no, it's they're like how did they the n times x uses the dark pumpkin texture because the dark pumpkin came out first because it came out during October, right? And then the end times X came out on October 31st only. So technically it was... I'm gonna go check something. Uh oh, what happened there? Did you see that? That was weird. Oh, excuse me. Move. I wonder if the fire texture is like the not just check that. <laughs> Is, not. Was that the idea that you had? Yeah. How much longer do you have left in the video? Oh gosh. Uh, we are at 26 minutes, so we still got four minutes of build and talk and time. Nah, somebody just called me. Oh no. Do you need to go? Nah, it was a Discord call. I gotcha. Excuse me, sir. Code. What's your Discord groups code? Uh, the group code? It's just code primate. Uh, by the way, if you'd like to join the Discord, it will be in the description down below. Whoa. Whoa! Code, can you please turn on the quad cell, please? <laughs> yeah, we'll go turn on the quad cell form. Why can't I get that on there? That is so weird. It's not letting me put the, oh, hold on. Oh, almost. Uh, I'm like face hitting. I can't, I can't get it on there. So weird. Wait, oh, 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 let's hit B. Let's move this. Move. Put that down here. I bet the chair was in, in the way. Oh, come here, come here. It'll take us like <gasps> No, 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 look, look. What up? Oh no. Wait, where'd the chair go? Look, oh no. Wait, um, is that a car? That is a car. That is glitched inside here. Um, I think that's two cars. No, no, no. Oh no. Oh no, wait, that's Merrill's car. It's the car and then some trailers. The train. Go res the train. Quick. It's glitched. Hurry. I think it's gone. It might be gone. Yeah, it's probably gone. Oh no, no it's no, still it's, back. <laughs> it's still under there. It's messing up all the stuff on the walls. Oh no, it's not. It's okay. It's definitely moving some things though. Music for train fight <laughs> intensifies. <laughs> we must stop the train. Oh, crazy. <laughs> well, uh, do you want to outro real quick and then we'll I'll go move the base so it's not right on top of the crazy yeah. train? Yeah. <laughs> crazy train. Ozzy Osbourne. Crazy. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Let's outro right here. Selfie time. Selfie time. Doing the outro. Let's go. There we go. Side by side, please. Side by side, please. Is that all six of us? That's the entire server. Look at that. Nice. He's <clears throat> trying to squeeze in between me and you. <laughs> Oh, hey, I just realized that, yeah, it is the entire server. 
Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate, as we build up the last part of the first level of the house. Um, got one piece to put in place. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Love you guys very much. Uh, if you'd like one of those awesome t-shirts, check out the Hello Juniper link. And um, the Discord link is in there, in the description down there as well. Love you guys. Have a great night. We'll talk to you soon. Bye!